Hello my fellow mermaids and thank you for tuning in. If you are new to my channel, welcome. I am doing a series called Athleisure Adventure. Pretty much I take a piece of workout item, bring them throughout my day and review them because workout clothing is not just about the clothing, how it looks, how it fits, it's how it holds up in your daily life because it's not the quality of the clothing you're wearing, it's the quality of the life in the clothing and the adventures and workouts that you get to do in said clothing. So today I will be reviewing the Hottie Hot Shorts from Lululemon, the four inch, they also do come in a two inch bringing them throughout my day letting you guys see them go on my shenanigans adventures and how they hold up and working out and doing whatever it is that makes you happy so let's get to it to the ocean we go to the ocean we are that made a lot louder noise than I anticipated it would how to bring attention to yourself one on one Fun fact about Halifax, these lampposts are called the drunken lampposts because they are literally shaped and falling down like they're wasted. Cool facts, cool facts. Don't you step on no crack and break your mama's back. Tip of the day. So much fluff. Not today, Lulu. Not today. I'm sorry. But we're still gonna wake girl out today. Don't worry. Don't worry. You already know. It's the MM <laughs> sweet thing. Yeah, I want that one. Is that everything today? Yeah. Five, six, nine. Seven. Attention basic nation. If you are about that mint chocolate chip ice cream life or those thin mint Girl Scout cookies, you, yes you, you walk on down to Starbucks, you ask for this, and then you're gonna drink it, and then you're gonna holler at your girl Kelty and you're gonna say, girl, I'm the girl, I know we got each other, but like, you done good Starbucks, you done good. talk specifics about the shorts. They have this waistband right here which has these elastics and then one elastic that's built and wrapped in all the way around. Now the only issue with that is I have heard some reviews of people saying after a few washes it like pops out and actually cuts into them. I haven't had that happen to me personally but be aware that in a few incidences it did happen. Some other things I really like about these shorts as well is how loose they are and just breezy. Perfect for a day to, like today. I was just walking around town. I'm one side light, so I didn't feel sweat and like stick to me. I'm one side loose, but I didn't want something like so baggy that I felt weight down. These are really lightweighted. As you can see, they have the panty liner in there. And what I really like about Lululemon's panty liner is very much just like a second skin to you. It's not frumpy. Like if you see a lot of running shorts, if you've ever tried them, they're literally wearing a diaper. And that is no fun. No, no, no fun. The issue for a lot of people with baggy shorts like this is of chaffing and not so much that these will actually cause chaffing but what will happen is they will bunch up, they will ride right up in there and then your thighs will rub together. If you've ever experienced that, comment down below. These are definitely designed for walking, running. I'd recommend the longer ones for running so you don't have to worry about hiking them up as much. If you are someone who has the chaffing, at least that's the material in between. If you're someone who doesn't have to worry about it and you have a bit of a gap in between your legs when you run, you can go with the shorter ones, like the 2.5 inch, and probably be okay. I would not recommend these for like a leg day just for the fact that they are baggy, so these could Ooh, hang out but because the 
like underwear line is so tight, you should be okay. You'll actually have coverage. Just keep in mind that might show in certain bends and squash and that. It just depends on your level of comfortability in showing that or not. Was that a hair? You want to see me squat in them? Okay, I will squat in them just to show you guys what I'm talking about. It's nice that they do have the pocket in there, so if you want to hide some keys when you're going running or hiking, you don't have to worry about carrying anything. These like a mid-rise, these are not a high-rise. You got these, which are nice and elastic-y, so you can pull it tighter. They're a very good material strength, because I said they actually have like elastic, like boop, 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 boop. One way to describe these is they would be like the perfect vacation shorts easy to throw on if you're a little sweaty they're okay they're loose they're breezy you could probably dress them up so if you've got these in like a white or a nude and or just a neutral color and paired them with like a white tank top you could easily dress these up which is nice if you're not like really sure on vacation if you're gonna go out to eat you can throw on some strappy sandals and totally make these more like athleisure have them is a very versatile item if you're on vacation or be walking around i usually show you guys my workout i didn't actually work out i've just been exploring all day and just a reminder Yes, if you have a specific goal, you should probably train in that way, but sometimes just going on long hikes and long walks and just moving your body for long periods of time are just as good as a workout. So that's not gonna help build muscle by any means. I have moved, can you see this? Almost 14 kilometers, just moving around, getting shots, just exploring, just taking advantage of the warm weather. And so that's okay, sometimes just get out and do things. It's kind of the equivalent of doing like list cardio, it's just moving for prolonged periods of time. Oh yeah, and this like white substance I got on there. I have no idea what that is. It could be yogurt, it could be paint. It just wasn't on there when I put these on this morning and now it's there, so there's that. So if you are looking for a comfortable pair of shorts that you just want to be able to easily throw on during the summertime for exploring, for hiking, for walking, for just general lifestyle wear, and that also you can wear in a workout, so if you don't know what you're going to do throughout the day, these are for you. They hold up. I've had them for a full year, and I'm totally happy, and no complaints. But let me know down in the comments if you've had any issues with the Lululemon Adiat shorts, because of course, that's just the thing about fitness clothing, is it's going to adapt to everybody's lifestyle a bit different, and it's all about what works for you specifically. Now, I'm 99.9% .9 sure that being an adult is being able to have French toast for dinner if you want. Four slices of French toast with peanut butter, some syrup, and yeah, you've got little fancy syrup holders. Yum, 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 yum. Now, mix, please, down the